Well, hey, everybody. Happy Thursday. Pastor Matt here with your daily RPM. Don't forget to give us a like and a share, and I do hope you're having a great day. Hey, this week we're talking about the miracles of Jesus. Today, I want to talk about a miracle that took place over time. The miracle that happened in the Apostle Peter's life. Do you know that when Jesus found Peter, he was a fisherman, he was married, now, he had some experience. When we see in Scripture, Peter actually had worked with John the Baptist for a time. But when Jesus asked Peter to be one of his disciples, he was very raw. He was an ordinary Jewish man. He had an ordinary job of being a fisherman. There was really nothing exemplary about his life. And as we study him from Scripture, we know he had a lot of flaws. But as Peter walked with Jesus, day after day, for three and a half years, something happened. He went from the Peter who would stick his foot in his mouth, the Peter who would fall asleep when Jesus needed a prayer partner, the Peter who sometimes said the wrong thing at the wrong time, the Peter who argued about position. This Peter became a great man of God. He, on the day of Pentecost, when the Holy Spirit was given, was the one that stood up and boldly proclaimed the word of God. And all of a sudden, Peter, who could not understand Jesus when he was face to face being taught by him, where Jesus had to say, Peter, you're acting like Satan, get behind me. Now, all of a sudden, Peter has this profound revelation of the Old Testament prophets, and he's preaching Jesus all the way through the Bible. What happened? It was a miracle that occurs in our life when we hang out with Jesus consistently over time. You see, there's many people, they come and they go, they come and they go. But if you want to be and have the type of life, this transformed, powerful, disciplined life of a, a, a Christ-following disciple, it comes from being transformed over time. It's not a quick fix. It's not overnight. You know, one, one time someone told me, a great man of God, he said, it takes 20 years to make a man of God. And I have to tell you, I agree with that wholeheartedly. It takes time. But if you'll stick with it, you say, well, I'm looking for this miracle or that miracle. One of the, listen, from my perspective, one of the greatest miracles we have as when people stay committed to the kingdom of God for their entire lifetime. God bless you. I'll see you tomorrow. If you like this video, like and share and follow my dad on Pastor Matt Ministries.